You're listening to WRFB Radio Free Britannia and no other freaking better place in the world than Deltona, Florida. Here you are, lunch with no other than the dynamic duo, Laz and Jack. Greetings, everybody. This is Laz. And this is Jack. Welcome to another edition of Lunch with Laz and Jack, where we interpret the news so you don't have to. That's right. Yeah. Bringing you our own here inside Trinity Avatar five days a week. How's everybody doing out there today? I know Jack's happy. He's playing stones over there. So well, he's a happy yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah, you know what? I, I had a great surprise. I uh, did my hair earlier and then I jumped in the shower and like right as Computer. I right as I'm Stop. getting wet. It's like it's getting wet. Yeah, right right as I right as I just got into the shower someone's knocking on the door and it's like an insistent kind of knock and so it's like wrapped a towel on and went and answered the door i'm not going away until you answer the door type exactly and it's like crap yep and then from there let him do his business got back in the shower finished off and then yeah finished his business finished my business i washed all the bits show it is Thursday, April 19, 2018, here inside Trinity Avatar. Yeah. Nice and sparkly clean. I mean, look. Hey, you know, I mean, nice, I'm so clean you nice can lick. on the top of the bean up there. Yeah, you can <laughs> lick me all over and it will be Ooh, clean baby. for now. Yeah, yep, yep. But yes, we, we've got that going on. And then, you, you, you know what's going to be happening later today what's happening later on today enlighten me well actually it's already happened it's what is it, it's already happened qa server's gone live oh well we i just actually just tweeted that out that well i nice. it, it, uh, you know what the tweety bird notification didn't come on my screen since we're no longer using tweet deck to spam a hundred thousand different accounts yeah so so Q, QA server is now I don't know, I don't know what you're talking about. Just not as easy to use, but it's still functional. I know. Anyway. It, it's it, it, it's one account you at a time. You should be getting notifications. That's what you should be doing. I, you should be getting notifications. You should be subscribed. I have not received a notification from NBNN or uh, uh, any of the other vir- various accounts in a long time. Well, maybe you should check to see if you're logged in. I I am absolutely (laughs) logged in. It's just not notifying my phone. Just not notifying. Yeah, so so Mm -hmm. I I don't know what's going on. But I will say that uh, the the porn tweets are are pretty entertaining. Oh, Uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, those updates from uh, free live web. Yeah, I mean, it's it's like opening up my Twitter in in public. It's like maybe I shouldn't do that as I now, scroll through. And now, uh, Duke Duke stopped in. Duke, are you there? I know I asked you to pop in and uh, say a few words. Are you listening and ready? Okay, I guess D- not. that answer is no. No, he's, he he's still is not with prepared at his door. Okay. Yeah. I'm sure he'll make his presence known. Yep. Yeah. Eventually but, uh, he will. Yeah, we were talking questions, lots of questions. Of course, now we also have uh, the QA is up, so uh, you can get out there and start testing all the new stuff. Uh, and with QA come release notes. So we've yeah, got right. a lot of lot of stuff to cover, a lot of stuff to talk about, a lot of stuff to speculate on as to how things are going to be in and uh, what's about to happen and all that fun stuff. So yeah, where are we yeah. going to start today? Jack? Well, you, 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 you know what? I got distracted by by the tweeter. Girl, 
Squirrel. The tweeter. Squirrel. The tweeter Lily. machine. No, no. <laughs> Lily is Third. under my bed, I think, right now. I mean, so she was on the bed, but I'm not seeing her on the bed right now, so... Yeah. She, she's probably underneath the bed. Yeah. So let's go ahead and talk about the stand-up corner. Uh, if let, let me stand up. L- l- let me refresh that puppy and make sure we got something to talk about here. Yeah, we yep. did. Yep, the, the Attenwood was uh, keeping us updated for yeah. yesterday's yeah. stand-up. Then let me let me look at Chris's. No, Chris didn't make an update. Then the then card. then we can actually yeah. start looking at the. Things that are coming in release 53 remind people. So we do have stand up. First and Can foremost. Also remind everybody that uh, no, no, Strategy sh- Avatar has got a free trial going well, it's on. It's a perpetual free uh, trial. Perpetually. Yeah. Perpetually. And that, uh, you can always come try it before you buy it. You're reading stuff out there and you're really curious. Come on in and try it for free, man. What do you got to lose? That's right. And then, then I can realize that. Hey, you know what? My bot's not connected. Connect, bot, connect. <laughs> I'm referring to my Discord bot. Or not yes. my Discord bot, my, my my Twitch bot. Okay, there. It, it should be connected now. Spam mm. the channel. Yes, it spams the channel. Spam. Okay, spam. so spam, spam, spam. spam. Wonderful spam. Okay, don't forget stand-up corners where the devs say, Hey, I worked on this yesterday. And I'm working on this today. Something random gets written down, eventually gets posted to the interwebs, and we get to interpret what the devs were yeah, doing right. in the past. I mean, and we've got devs on the, on the lot, and they'll they'll sit there and say, "Oh man, what the hell are y'all doing?" Yeah, they'll they'll scream at the, us if the, the, yeah. Oh, is is there we, uh, is there a face palm emote? There is. Okay, it, it is. It, do do I have it? You should. I don't know why yeah, you would. Yeah, yeah, I do. Okay, I got the face palm emote. Because that is the normal thing that you should be doing, is the face palm emote. Uh, but, so, over in the art department, we have Damon. Damon Walton. We're going to fireworks and water visual effects and bathtub visual effects. Bathtub. Yeah, see. Yeah, I got some... You need, no. you need the rubber duckies for the bathtub. <laughs> and then, so, or in the bathtub, is there going to be an emote where you, you, like, take your hands, cup the air? And no. Boom, it's, boom, uh, boom, and, and I don't, I don't dish- want to say I told you so, but what? I told you so. With what? This. <laughs> what what'd you tell me? <laughs> or, or is it going to have bubbles coming up from underneath you? No, fireworks. Uh, okay. What about fireworks? Yeah, they're you're right. They're bigger and better, but they're also new. There's they didn't just make the old yeah. ones better. More, again. more fireworks. Hey, you, yeah. you know what? If you're looking for the old fireworks, I'll probably be posting some up for sale on Shroud Marketplace. Uh, and so will Lass, and so will a dozen other people. Uh, Fletcher. Fletcher. Working on obsidian armor and heraldry and. Pirate NPCs that only Arr. say R. 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 Yes. Then the ugly fist working on the ugly fist NPC updates. The almighty Gix Vargach working on <laughs> bathtub fidgets. Fidget. I don't know how you fidget in the bathtub. Did we just have that conversation yeah, before the show? Maybe. <laughs> yeah, but I also said I, I, I can't do that in the shower. But yeah. Um, <laughs> Spellcasting, animations. Then Reed, working on the bathtubs. Yeah. And Earth statues. Or Elf statues. If I could learn to read. Elf. Read it, baby, read it. Elf statues. They're going to be very elven. Scotty. It's working on physical goods and the player manual. Mm-hmm. Over in design, Beezus. The Beezinator. Working on fireworks setup and bugs. Bugs. Seawolf. 
He's got a he's got a map review and terrain updates and Laz's favorite bugs. Bug. Dan the man. What's he up to? Map review, tenebris, tenebris puzzle, harbor puzzles, and Pinmore Island puzzles, Pinmore. and Pinmore. East March. Pinmore. Pinmore. <laughs> I, I, I don't know who came I don't up know with why that. I name. like that so much. I just. Pinmore. Yeah. Pinmore. Sanyo working on the map review and devotional quests. Lum the Mad. Updating some backer NPCs. How mad is he? I don't know. Read his Facebook and then you'll realize that it's like... Well, I, I, man, I, I, I tell you what. is Every time I do yeah. a refresh and I go out there, Scott's at the top of the list. Always. Oh, man. It's like, yeah. Always got some interesting stuff to... Uh, yeah, and, 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 and I, I will say that my, my post of the virgin coconut oil from uh, Central Market has... I I don't know why like fourteen people have laughed at that picture. I don't know. I mean, you're I, just I, asking. I, I know it's like I'm asking whether or not if anybody's got any recommendations on it, and it's like, yeah. man, it's like I heard it was the bomb, and I'm looking for some confirmation. No one has said whether or not it's good or bad yet. Uh, they they just laugh. Where is Sir Sir Steve's working on the map review? In Quell Shard Fall Polish and Tenebrous Harbor. The Energy Vortex. He's blowing through the bugs. Bug. Yep, and terrain updates. Over in tech, Dr. Bob. Little Bobby Thompson. Working on bugs and player Bug. metrics. Wizard smoke. Yep. Uh, yeah. No, that just is out. That that deserves a shot. That's right. Blow it straight into the camera. Yeah, yeah. It doesn't work on mine, at least not the way I see. It. I, I'm a little closer to the camera, so it's like I'm at, I am at arm's length to the camera. He's working yeah, on I'm looking not... for a group. Looking for a group. LFG. I'm going to yeah. be uh, interested to see how that functions. Well, remember, this is going to be the first iteration of it, and it's probably on the QA server, so time to start patching up those clients on the QA server. Test out that LFG tool. And although I don't know if it's actually going to make release 53 or not, I'm hoping it does. We don't know. We don't it's, know that. Uh, we know it's in the work. The, we can tell you. The Deathbringer, one and only... Working on bugs. Only. And performance. Performance? Performance. What kind of performance? The kind that's so much fun that you don't know what's going on. I hate when that happens. Yeah. The Rock. He's working on map lot automation and housing icon integration and bundle upgrades. Bundle upgrades. Are we finally gonna see those Fakotos in the store? Maybe I yeah, don't know. I, I I don't know about maybe. that. I don't know. I I thought that was. We don't know if we're gonna be able to do that or not. I thought that's what that was. Well, we'll find out soon yeah. enough. That's for sure. Yeah, Andrea working on bug forms and sanity testing. Oh my. Yeah, the game taking a minute to exit is rather annoying. Um, well, at least it's exiting now and not crashing. Uh, well, most of the time. You, you, you know what? It's, uh, there are still crashing issues, but yeah, that's, that's another another issue. Well, they're working on it, and it is a lot I more know, stable I than know. most of the games. I mean, sh that that are, hey, I, are I've seen just some uh, POSs come out, you know, that yeah. just, yeah. And fortunately for us, I mean, this game has been relatively stable the entire development cycle. So, uh, although a couple of releases were much iffier than they, than others, sitting on a lot became a thing. <clears throat> well, it's our thing, man. It's our thing. Uh, then after that, we do have uh, 
Barrick working on town spotlights and streamer promotions and store updates. Mm. Hey, speaking of streamer pr promotions, have I made the list? I even complained about it on Facebook. Did you? I hadn't had no uh, look, uh, to tell you the truth. Yeah, you know who's not there? Let me guess. Jack's not there. I I, I, I don't know, man. I, I don't know. I'm just like, add me. I'm... You gotta go straight to the rock, man. I'm telling you. I know, I know. It's like, uh, yeah. Gotta go to the rock. Who do I have to kill in order to appear mm -hmm. on the streamer list? Okay, send him that message. Then after that, let's see, re the Attenwood is working on partner support and Jira's and customer service review and sanity testing. Hey, there's your answer. <laughs> where, where, where's my answer? No, that, no, I don't know. I that, that was the, the, that's the New York Times talking about Prince's overdose. Oh, is uh, they just catching up with that? Yeah, and, and supposedly my name wasn't on the spreadsheet that Barrett gave him. It's like, seriously, oh, it's like killing me, Smalls. Hey man, killing me. Yeah. Uh, then after that, over in Useless Overhead, we do have the Dippy Bird. The Bird. Working on leads meeting and profiling and memory performance. Hey, man, that's avatar profiling, man. I know. Not right. Yeah. And then, then Gorn is working on physical goods direction mm -hmm. we know which way we're going with that to you yeah. and a couple of releases folks these uh, things are gonna ship uh, yeah so two, again, two more months two more months those addresses up there two more months so and i don't know sure. i don't know where it's gonna go you to still don't know where yours are going dude. yeah uh, <laughs> it's like how would I unlock things? Yeah, we'll, we'll find out later this week. That's right. And for those of you overseas folks who want to get rid of your copies, you can contact Jack or I. We'll be more than happy to help you uh, offload those. You can use our address. Yeah, definitely send them all straight to me, and I'll, I'll find a way to uh, keep them. Um, then meetings and contracts. Hutch, working on bug fixes. Bug. And it help. And map review. In character review and decorations. Sasha working on Travian meetings and user metrics and general business and business. finances. The Dork Star working on stress test prep and schedules and map review and character review and release 53 post and interview prep and community meetings and weekly update and forums and Jira triage. And then and then and and then he went home. <laughs> Yeah, Star's only working on just a little bit of stuff. There, just just a few things. I mean, he's got to get his yeah. playlist probably set up for Monday. Yeah. For, for, the, for yeah. those of you who don't know, uh, that's, that's where the useless overhead joke comes from. Uh, yeah. It's actually a Star Long quote. Oh, when, when I'm, that's I'm, what he does here one Oh, I'm time, just Star useless Long overhead. Is, is yeah. Turned around, extended his hand, and says, I'm just useless overhead. And yeah, the rest mm. has been history, you know. And, That's right. Uh, we, we, we love him because, you know, he's star. What can I say? Oh, yeah. We say, and that's what your developers were working on yesterday, right here inside Shroud of the Avatar. Excellent, excellent. And a lot of stuff being worked on. Uh, Release 53 Post has got all sorts of goodies, Shh. you know. And uh, you're, you're spoil well, well, spoilers, spoilers, man. Spoilers, because you, ju you just uh, actually mentioned the streamers program, and uh, the streamers program, a little perk, we little perk. What, what, what's what, what we we perk if you show up on the QA server at three o'clock on a Whatever no, day that is, that Monday? One. Not that one? Uh, we're, gonna, we're getting our own cameras. So we'll actually have streamer cameras to uh, Oh, streamer to cameras. Use. Yeah. Okay. But but don't forget, I mean, that stress test on the QA server on Monday? 
That's right. Oh, yeah. uh, let's, let's talk about that uh, yeah. for a couple of minutes here. Uh, for everybody out there, again, the uh, QA server is up. It is open to the public these days. So all you got to do is go out to the uh, release 53 forms and find the uh, posting right Thank there. Uh, the posting server. is, what's that? Oh, someone followed. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Mm. Yay. Yeah, so Monday, 3 p.m. Central Time. You need to be on the QA server Central in God. the town of Rift's End. Uh, go f hunt down the Queen of Chaos, which is Dark Star's uh, his his ship, which travels around. Uh, and they're going to be trying to uh, profiling uh, some combat metrics with lots of people, as well as the dance party, of course, and uh, trying to crash the server again. Um, the, which means it will just slow to a, a crawl for everybody around. But yes, they are working on that. Oh. And if 50 people, at least 50 people show up at the party for 45 minutes, 45 they're going to give consecutive minutes. everyone right. in the game double XP for one week on the live servers. Indeed. So please help them out if and remember the qa client is a free download you just have to click on that qa server link and uh, i'll go ahead and copy link address and i'll start posting that around in different places um then after that um nice guy you uh i know it's like now i gotta find your twitch channel which means <laughs> chatty and then click and then boom it's all over the place boom boom hey. it is there so we do have that. So 45 minutes on the QA server in the town of Rift's End. And you yeah, know what? At least 50 people. Everybody gets double XP for a week. That's right. So, you know, Good. if you don't get it, we're going to blame you. No. <laughs> That's right. Who, who do you blame if we don't get double XP? Blame everybody because nobody showed up. I, I don't think we're going to miss, mm. uh, miss this. I think everybody's going to show up and uh, do what they got to do to get that. Yeah. Yeah. That's, that's just my guess. But uh, what do you want to do? So I'm going to do some questions. You want to answer yeah, some uh, you, you questions know what, for boys and girls? You want you want to slowly start I chipping did, did, away did, at did. What, what we know as the early, early, early release notes. You want to save that? Yeah. You want to save some release notes for tomorrow? And we'll do questions. Uh, well, whatever. I mean, I've got the questions as long as I didn't do things, or we uh, could do release fifty three stuff. Uh, although I don't have the release fifty three stuff right in questions. front of me. Oh, hold on. Let's hold jump on. to some questions. Let's. Uh... Hold on. Hold on. Uh, dun, 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 dun. Mm -hmm. yeah, I'm easy. I'm, I'm, I go either way. I'm I'm cl I'm clicking around so that way I can get it ready for tomorrow. <laughs> oh, you're doing tomorrow's show prep today. I, I, I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> so Elnoth had the question: Do mobs have attunement values? Uh, when you talk about attunement and resist, that is all fine for PvP. But I'm also wondering if attunement gives any PVE benefits with regards to defense. Yeah, you know what? Before even thinking about that, I want you to go attack a fire elemental with fire or an earth elemental with earth. See what happens. Come back and talk to us. I yeah. Try. They, as Chris says, they have attunement values that get used for some spell effectiveness, but only a, only a few currently. They mostly have resists. If you want to go see how they work, go fight an obsidian golem of any size. Or go talk, go talk to an earth elemental and or a fire elemental, water elemental, uh, or a phoenix and see what happens. And use like the appropriate school against them. Clank wants to know: Would it be possible to show guild name of people when you target them? It's hard enough to see who is enemy and who is ally. And he's talking PvP here. Chris says, "Agree and yes." Ooh. 
You, you, you know oh, what? You, you, too funny. What What are you talking about? I was just watching one screen as you're reading, and somebody came up and uh, started hacking on Rock there and uh, Rock's flag PVP. And huh? Who's attacking and, Rock? Uh, uh, he came and left. He's still getting the residual zero. Hit, uh, okay. Zero hit, zero yeah. Hit. <laughs> that's awesome that is awesome somebody tried to gank him and ran off I uh, didn't catch that on camera I didn't see yeah. him on that I, I gotta go. all I caught was somebody slashing him up uh, that was Ch Chalador Chalador he, he, yeah okay. he, he rendered him quadruple slash double slash thrusted him I mean he he, he, he was trying to poke him but I mean I, unfortunately the the rock is hard as a rock and he just can't be penetrated that easily <laughs> took you a while on that one and Matt, I was waiting to see if anybody uh, else judge, you know? yeah no, no one else will I mean they, they, I know they, they don't know what to do full of people it's the quietest yeah. room I've ever I, heard I know. room filled full of people that don't say anything Malachi wants to know, how do you feel about the current targeting? Sometimes it's quite hard to see which target is targeted due to such similarity mm -hmm. in the new nameplate. Uh, the, the, then the rock finally, is, he, he did the double face palm in, in, in my Twitch chat. <laughs> it's like, I, I don't know what the hell's going on. It's like, please stop. Please don't do it again. Uh, highlight strength is tunable, but agree. There should be more of a tell in the nameplate as that is a little less immersion breaking so yep tweaks tweaks will be co incoming at some point in time in the future uh zador wants to know does rapid finally really need to be on a 15 second cooldown and it's like hell yeah it does yes it hell does. yeah it does even with that it is one of the most popular skills if he lowered that any more archers would just do rapid fire 100 percent of the time it's so true so Pretty true to begin with anyway as much as they can so yeah uh zador wants also wants to know can we make decks more useful bump us up a bow's native crit rate or at least give any archery skill to increase crit chance swapping strength for decks is really painful as it is now chris says he wants a full dex archer i know what he's doing Dude, dude, I miss my Dex monkey. Him. I miss my Dex him. monkey. I mean, you know. I yeah. Don't you miss your Dex monkey? Yeah, you know, I, I I miss how easy it used to be, man. You could just load up whatever the hell you wanted and go. But uh, yeah. I need to plink, 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 plink something. Plink, 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 plink. Plink, plink, plink. Dead. Then we also have um, Chris's responses. Critical chance needs to be not go much higher or it ends up removing the ability to defend. Uh, he's been considering the increasing its contribution to generating misses. So if you have a high dex, that means you've got a higher avoidance. I don't know. Shroud math. Build up that dex. Yeah. Uh, the, the one skill that most people don't find early I, I know i didn't originally yeah. and uh you know i i hear a lot of people go where can i find my decks yep well malachi wants to know can you please explain how crit works and with yeah. no, no visible value it makes it hard to build around and uh zador also wants to know can you explain how crit is calculated both hit and da damage Shroud answer, Shroud Math. Shroud Math, um, go watch some of his tech talks <laughs> with Violation. Right yeah. This is a huge topic that he's covered several times already, and he thinks that he covered this in the last tech talk video he did with Duke Violation. Short version is chances based on dex, gear, and skills for damage. Instead of doing X and Y like a normal hit, it does Y to Y times x damage multiplier shroud math this is usually around two to two and a half but with skills you can get it up to 3.5 plus from behind attacks add that to the multiplier as well the base chance for ranged decks is the base chance for ranged is dex divided by divided 400 by. and for melee it's dex divided by a thousand 
Yeah. Now, do I get backstab with my uh, staff when I'm slapping yeah, yeah. him over the head with a staff? Yeah, yeah, you know what? Who needs to Two go? Staff? I need to go unlock something in the uh, dex tree. Where I, I gotta look to see where backstab is. Because I, I may not. I sh oh, good. I can, I can unlock backstab. Yay. Thankfully. Uh, can we get a lock on the combat bar from Elas? Yeah, yeah, we'll, yes. we'll, we'll get that as soon as we... He likes the idea. He's making a task for it. I'm I'm used to the hotkeys, so he doesn't notice as much uh, for the clicking, dragging skills accidentally. So, yeah, that is good. Um, we know. We, we, we know. So you know Chris is a keyboard player. Yeah, you yeah, know what? You should see the way I play first-person shooters. Uh -huh. Pew, pew, That's pew, right. Pew. It's it's like... I, I finally got off the old Hexen config for uh, first-person shooters. <laughs> finally. It's only 2018. Game, game from like 96, 97, <laughs> somewhere in there. Uh, can we get a list of players, including yourself, to be unlocked so we can remove... Move it around your screen. User interface updates. Yes, we can get that as soon as Wizard Smoke returns from his honeymoon. It should be an easy mm -hmm. fix. We're just waiting on Wizard Smoke to come back from his honeymoon. So as soon as we get it, we'll also fix the locking glyph thing. So. Yeah. yeah. We got a jeer for that. And I don't know how defected Zephyr plays Shroud with a controller. You know, um, I've actually seen a couple posts, a couple few people post that they use controllers. Not enough buttons for me. Sure there are. You get one of them 20 some odd button controllers, you can do just about everything you need to do. Uh, okay. Yeah. Uh, and, uh, I have a controller somewhere. I think it's in the garage. But I haven't hooked that thing up in years. It's got so much Hi, dust on it. Hi, and Dr. Nick. Hi, Draker. And Lorraine wants to know. Oh wait, sorry, sorry. Um, Ishil wants to know: Is it a Ishil's a new player? Is there a plan new to player. make it to make it so that you are able to bind items to hot bars for quick access? Yes. Not enough buttons. Welcome to the Steam controller. Yeah, Ooh, yeah, and those nice were like Zephyr. those were like super cheap, like ten dollars at Christmas, something like that. And I didn't get one. Uh, and that that is actually all I wanted was a Pepsi. I know, just one Pepsi. Uh, Lorraine wants to know: Can we pin recipes at a crafting station to the top of the list so we see them first? That's a great idea. Star says yes. And remember, star, whenever Star says yes, that's really a non-answer. It's sure, sure, it can happen in the future, but I'm not going to tell you when or yeah, where it might uh, happen. Anybody who understands Shroud speak, yeah, that that yeah, means it, sure we can do it. Could doesn't mean yeah. it's going to happen? Doesn't mean it's on the schedule. Just means sure we can do it. You could do it. Yeah. And again, I believe a lot of this will get in, so let's not let's not slap slap them around too hard. A lot yeah. Of, and these have Jira's in the background working and the other good stuff. Uh, yeah. And then after that, we do, uh, Lorraine also wants to know: Can we please get a refresh icon on the map window for the current zone? Perhaps. Maybe. Maybe yeah, well, that's always nice. Maybe but, uh, maybe maybe the rock will do it. The rock, yeah, well, he's working on some stuff that uh, we're not going to talk about right just yet. But uh, hey, good stuff. The, he's the, the rock on is doing that. an awesome job. That's all, all I got to say. He, he yeah. is, and uh, uh, a list about yay long. Um, short yeah, short right. short list. We're gonna down the line just a, just a small little list Sh uh, short list short list of what he's been trust working on. me he, he he's keeping busy they're, they're making him earn his keep down there that's for sure yep Icondus. 
I, I, I would ask him to read out his own question, but yeah. get over here. He, 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 he's not in voice chat right now. <laughs> uh, for consistency, consider extending the control key world map functionality for boat access con- uh, POTs to other POT types and NPC towns instead of mousing over the I on the town name. Um, hmm. He'll consider it. Yeah. Interesting. Yeah, that that's a suggestion and not a question. <laughs> so, yeah. Yes. <laughs> Feature request. Yeah, yeah. Brass Knuckles wants to know, could we get an add-on store item that would allow you to port to another house you own with another I- item? I'd love quick travel from one of my houses to another, and I'm willing to pay for it. Unlikely, Good says the Magic yeah. 8 Ball, but it will be considered. As in, not going to happen, because not I... Not in this lifetime. Uh, will Infernal wants not to know, will you do a zombie do merchant pattern for Halloween? Fun idea. Fun idea. Hmm. Fun idea means more than likely it will happen. You ready? I'll give you that. Oh, that yeah. So, someone just opened a beverage. I wonder who it was. Do you have your Pepsi? I do. Excellent. Uh, are we a toast to something? I don't know. Uh, you got to love this next name. Let's the see. Grape oh, Ape. I thought it was a Pepsi, but I got mine. Grape Ape wants to know, can we have the option to set recall and or teleport to use an emote of our choosing? Also a fun idea. What's the matter? You don't like the constipated look that is currently there? Hmm. I, I kind of like the constipated look, especially you if you like could do that, that while sitting. If you could do that while seated, that would be phenomenal. And s- supposedly, back in like what release fifty one, Star said, "Yeah, we can do that." So maybe you'll be able to teleport recall while seated, and blow up the bathroom. And then uh, let's see, Z- uh, <laughs> yeah. It's like the picture came to mind of your thank you screen, and I just my my follow screen. I can just see you yeah, making a new. One. I, I, um, I I I I popped in my mind. <laughs> it's like, <laughs> and then around you. and then just disappear. I I don't know. I I I kind of I kind of like the the cheering on the toilet a little bit more. Um, Maybe, maybe I would have to change yeah, the. You, you can have optional yeah, ones so that they I know. rotate. You know. Uh, maybe I should make that the donation emote whenever somebody oh, tips me. Yeah, that it's. Yeah, scatological humor is on tap around here. <laughs> Slugnor oh. wants to know. Could we get craftable armor stands or mannequins so we can display suits of armor as if they're being worn? My virtue armor doesn't look so epic stuffed in a on, in a bag on the floor. Yes, that is something that has been requested over and over again. We do know that it is coming at some point in the future. We just don't know when. So it is now, on the list. I, I've seen uh, all sorts of armor and uh, costume. Yeah. In, uh, in a museum and we can do better we can definitely do better because oh, yeah. it'll look better on a dress on a table or on a shelf that's for sure yep post launch folks hey man it constant development here from that's the guys right. at portalarium that is something wait, that, wait till yeah. y'all see what's coming this next release i don't know haven't looked at it yet stop the spoilers man I, well, I'm sorry, you know, it yeah. came out last night. I had to, had to peruse it last night, download um, the client. I haven't logged in yet, though. Okay, so okay. Today. Yeah. I'm going to go look for group later on this afternoon. Can we get uh, the alchemy uh, ring to work with enchanting rather than alchemy so it's in line with the other crafting perk items? Yes. 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 Bahamut... Yeah, we have- yeah, the, I, I will say that alchemy needs a ton of love. Please have some love for your alchemists. I'm not going to say. You, you know what? I, it's like I still want the ability to craft scrolls from other schools and like turn it into like the 
uh, what was that UO skill? Um, for inscribing. Inscription. Yeah, I I, oh, I, yeah. I missed that. Be able to uh, yes, like craft a nice field scroll and be able to use. Oh that. yeah, it, and um, and it would be based off of your skill in that school, and so that way, if someone's not fluent in say the ice tree they could use a spell kind of like a but if you if I you gotta, i gotta disagree with you well, the idea behind this scroll was a scroll was almost a guarantee so the scroll and the power and the potency of the scroll should be on the level of the inscriber yeah that's what that's what i'm talking about okay. the level of the inscriber okay. Okay. Yeah, and, okay. and that way the level of the inscriber <laughs> So th the reason I say that is because there's that silly thing um, when in order to unlock the fire elemental, right? If I'm if my real combat tree, as far as magic goes, is fire, and I want to unlock that fire elemental, I actually have to go kill a fire elemental that has what twenty two or twenty two thousand. Uh, 2200 uh, hit points and all of my fire magic it is in invulnerable to it's so, so right. it, it is completely resistant to it so everything in that fire tree is completely useless but i have to kill it in order to and how many invites i get to go kill a phoenix or kill uh, the fire elemental zara yeah and i just go listen man so I'm useless to you out there so i'm not even gonna bother yeah so so it's it's one where it's like you know what but if i could take some scrolls because i don't have any ice magic then mm -hmm. i could go i could go out and kill it and i could have i could carry some scrolls from opposing schools that i could use to attack things in the near future i mean i think that would be a cool idea and it would give some alchemy some love i i all that stuff but uh real quick let's just see uh the duke ever get back here duke are you here are you listening Did you ever get back in here he's gonna show up at 11 58 or 1159 right at the end <laughs> and he's gonna be like what the hell oh 59 yeah anyway Hi, Lily. Yep, yeah. and you see Lily loving up on the, the headphones. It's like, uh, uh, oh, yeah. The uh, shameless self-promotion portion yeah. of the day. But uh, how about one or two more questions, uh, and we'll move on. I don't know. I, I don't know. Uh, uh, Bahamut Ark wants to know something. As a main tamer, I would love to see my Drake pet. Where's our Drake? Ain't gonna happen. No, no, no. Chris and Star say it's coming. Coming. Remember, Drake is not not a, not a dragon. It's gonna be very small. Hi, Lily. And then Bahamut Ark also wants to know, as a Pokemon lover, never got into it. Uh, I would love to. I would like to breed my pets to get a chance to have a stronger one. Can this work within Soda? Unlikely, but pet leveling and skill unlocking for pets is our long-term plans. Very cool. Yeah. One last question. How about that? Yeah, do that. I'll okay. be right back. Rufus wants to know, will we be able to apply approved devices to multiple items of the same type, banner shields, or are we limited to the patterns and eternal patterns that we cur we have currently? Uh, heraldry will only be able to be applied to heraldry patterns. I, I'm confused by that. So I guess they're limiting the number of heraldry items that you could possibly identify. So by that limitation, uh, lots of people are going to be sad because one of the things that has been talked about people previously... People got no patience. No. Nope. Got no patience. Okay. Jump down, Lily. Jump. Yeah, thank you for not taking my headphones and with just, you. And you know what? Just because you ain't got no patience, I ain't going to tell you what I know till tomorrow. So you can okay. find out tomorrow about that. <laughs> yep. 
Okay, so I got I got a cat hair up my nose and I hate when Oh that man. It's like it's like just right there at the tip. I mean, it's like come on. Just a tip. I know, man. it's just like a tip. it's a fine hair sticking in the nose somewhere. <laughs> Like, how am I going uh, to have to go digging for gold later just to get that one hair out? Yes, everybody's got to keep in mind that the heraldry items that were released were released to people who had pledge rewards that had to be fulfilled. That doesn't mean that's it. It's not going to be, you know, and that's all you're going to get. They've got a plan, and I know what the plan is, but I ain't telling y'all till tomorrow. <laughs> Don't don't know what you're talking about. I don't know. Don't might, don't might be might might be something in the notes or somewhere I might have read. I don't so, know. Something about reading ahead early into the yeah, release fifty three. Being a news guy to just uh, you find all yeah, this stuff. Out I know there. it's like you read when stuff you and you discover read things. The documents, yeah. That's right. Yeah. Don't know what read you're talking about. Box. Yeah. <laughs> I love this shit. Okay, you ready for That's your your right. spiel? Not yet. I gotta find the right tab. Oh, you've got to find. Yes, you've got to find the NBNN app tab. And don't the forget one that. in the forums so that I get to see the nice, pretty big, uh, big picture of you and I, and the actual logo for the NBNN Trad of the Avatar app. So when they see it, they know that's the NBNN Trad of the Avatar. Yeah, app. And, and that's right. I don't even know and what I course, did with that forum post. It's available in the Google Play Store, the Apple iTunes Store, or the Amazon App Store on all your electronic devices. So don't be on one or the other. We've got them all covered. Updated on a regular basis. You can check out the website. You can check out the calendar. You can check out the Twitch and YouTube channel. Yeah, better testing one, two, three. Twitch and YouTube channels, all sorts of other good stuff. Listen to the ribbon map read the forums but of course again that leads into i know i already said it the calendar yeah you know what that community calendar is on nbnn.info uh, nbnn. nbnn. click on the calendar button you can go right there don't forget uh the community calendar is actually an aggregate of all of the available google public calendars related to shroud of the avatar that that guy knows about if you have a google public calendar or if you want to add events to the Shroud community calendar, you need to email news at nbnn.info and eventually he'll do something about it and I might start reading off your events. That's right. Calendar brought to you by Hometown Hero. Yes. If you're a vapor out there and you're looking for some custom me, check out Hometown Hero. Click on the link. Go check out what they got to offer. Save 20% when you check out. Use the promo code NBNN. Then don't forget all times on the calendar are central time in the real world, but we prefer to refer to it as nude Britannia time. Nude Britannia time. Yeah, other... What's the damn problem? Hey, finally, you problem. showed up. Three times we call you, for, come on and talk to us, and you ain't there. But, uh, it's all good. I had a bunch of crazy people show up at my house. I had to get the shotgun down off the mantle. I'll tell you, you okay. got all sorts of shit. Well, let's finish the calendar real quick, right and then we'll, we'll, let, we'll let Zeke right. talk about right SodaCon. So don't forget, Monday through Friday, 12s and 6s is around the clock. You need to tune in to Radio Free Britannia to listen to two Radio idiots Radio. interpreting the news so you don't have to on a little show called Lunch mm -hmm. with us. At 6 p.m. on Avatars Radio, you've got Doc DJ Selleth doing it faster and louder. louder. At 7 p.m., the Phoenix Republic is doing their PVE nights. Just message e. K's in Phoenix Fire or Malahari for more information if they're in game. At 10 p.m. is the Temper Tantrum today on Avatars Radio. And the final event of the evening is on Radio Free Britannia. Wait, you missed the 70s. Oh, oh, wait, 70s at yeah. 7, and then final event is the record room. Yeah, yeah, yeah. W. Oh, oh, right. Hey, remember, I did say I might read it out. That's right. Yeah. No might. guarantees. No guarantees. <laughs> All depends on how I'm feeling. That's but that right. is our community calendar uh, for 
Torta Thursday. Right here. Yes. Mm -hmm. But Zeke. Yeah. The, yeah. Uh, Zeke, yeah, Zeke, Zeke, Zeke. There, there's this SodaCon thing. What, what are you going to tell us about that? Well, okay. I mean, what, what kind of questions? I can go through what questions I have received. I'll talk about a few things. One thing is the land party. I got a lot of people that's wondering about the land party. And well, that is... Uh, let's, go let's ahead. Let's do it this way. SodaCon Austin 2018, October 11th to 13th. What right. are we doing during SodaCon? So far, we have a reception on the 11th. I believe it's at 5 p.m. Might be 7 p.m. On the 11th for all the VIPs. It's a VIP reception. It'll be at uh, uh, Opal Divines. All that information will be put on the website and in the uh, soda forums. Uh, then, what, the next day, Friday... We're going to kick off the panels. I think Winfield's going to try to kick the panels off around 10 a.m. Might be 9 a.m. But it's a little right earlier, we'll be kicking but the 10 a.m. is better. It's, uh -huh. it's theme day, according to the <laughs> right. calendar, as garb is encouraged. And uh, again, there's a whole bunch of events uh, planned. This is, again, I'm looking at the schedule at a glance, just the... Uh, early uh, version of what's going to be going on at SodaCon. Where we're yeah. at right now, what we are working on, oh yeah, the dance party is definitely a go. That's on Saturday night. That was uh, a great one be, last year. Yeah, that'll be in the uh, San Marcos room at the Renaissance Austin Hotel. Uh, the panels will be Friday and Saturday, I believe. Correct. We're going to the Barons Men Theater, uh, the VIPs and whoever wants to go, uh, we'll all be going to the Barons Men Theater Friday night, I believe. Yes, that's uh, the, yeah, on the schedule. Friday. That's Friday night. Okay. And then Saturday night is the King's Dinner. Now, and the VIPs have uh, VIP access to all that stuff. They that's correct. Preferred seating at the... Uh, right. The preferred seating at the King's Dinner. Yeah. All the course, VIPs, uh, they'll have reserved seating at the convention itself uh, during the panels. They'll have a reception when they when they get there on they Thursday get night. Both of themselves and yeah, just to them. Aside from, yes, right. Very aside good. from, yeah. plus they've got the tour. You got the tour of Portalarium in that package as well. Uh, uh, two tours this year, right? That is correct. Is, uh, Tours have been a popular thing, and of course, last year those sold out pretty quick. How many tickets we got left for the VIPs? There are point? there are eleven tickets left in all. That means there are five tickets left, uh, five tickets left on the one thirty tour, and there are six tickets left on the uh, three thirty tour. And guys, I'm gonna tell you now: if you haven't got it and you want to be a VIP and take that Portalarium tour better get it while the getting's good because when that 20th ticket sells it's done there, there will it. be no more opportunity until next year and, and i believe someone is actually working on some costume rentals for the theme day oh we we we, we hear say but we have uh, no guarantees yeah no no, no guarantees as of yet it's, but it's it in is the works it's and in the works yes working on that yes uh, all the land party the land party location land party. is in the works as well is uh, that out. was so impromptu last year, and it happened both nights, and we're going to try and make sure. And it that was that packed again. The land party it was, was a big was. thing. It was a big thing last year. Yeah, yeah. I, I can't hold my desktop down there and my monitors. That would suck. Buy a new laptop for crying out loud. Man, yeah, I mean, we had a room. There must have been 30 laptops, 20 or 30 I'll laptops. And hey, yeah, you, cool. you, you know what? Someone actually asked me about It's like, man, why haven't you bought new shoes? It's like, no. <laughs> no. Flip flops are my general wear around almost everything. But, but yes, no flip flops. But now, can I say a word real quick yes, outside right. of SodaCon? And then we got to move on to our okay. clothes. So, what the do you DLC, got? is going to have a real life BMC guild house down there. Nice. Uh, oh yeah, I heard you say you uh you got a found a rental, didn't you? Found a house with a pool, a hot tub, 
All Very right, cool. sleeps up oh, twelve shucks. people. Thank you for the sub. Very cool. So yeah, we we got that in the work for the BMC, and once we get it secured, thing that I'm trying to push behind that is that it will be on the from the tenth to the fifteenth. Once the BMC gets that pushed and gets that secured, uh, we will be having our own little private get together and course friends of the bmc will be welcome to that event nice very on a cool. sunday very cool indeed well you know you know you sign me up i'll be it, right on that now bad boy. okay so the real question is yeah because you do, know do i have to wear getting... pants in the pool or the hot nope. tub okay nope. excellent. excellent no you excellent. know you're part of the bmc <laughs> too <y 'all. laughs> i don't know that's your that's yeah, no, you know how we are. You don't uh, have to be. You don't have to wear any I, clothes. You can count on when when and I to definitely be in on, it, uh, especially if it's got the uh, yeah. you know communities and we ain't got to worry about you know hotels and all that crap. Right. But anyway, we'll talk about that. But uh, great stuff going on, and of course, don't forget uh, this is the second year in a row that we're doing the uh, SodaCon down in Austin under the SodaCon brand. And we're going to continue to bring it to you as long as possible. Yep. Hang in there with us because uh, we're just getting started, people. The uh, launch was just uh, last month and uh, we are rolling. We're looking forward to the next release, which is going to be the first actual release after launch. And uh, looking forward to the updates there. But real quick, we got to thank you to the folks to help keep us going over here of course don't forget you're watching nbnn on nbnn.info twitch.tv nbnn news nbnn youtube reruns radio don't know what you're talking about We're now we thank you of course uh, thank you for that sub there again frost shot we appreciate that for all you folks who have amazon prime you subs, uh, you can be like B. Donham there. Thank you for those cheers. 100 bits from B. Donham. We love you guys and we appreciate it. Very fun. Become a supporter today and play for a cause. Thanks to you folks. 1,200 plus people are getting help from last month's Ripple Effect. And now we'll be bringing you the next community cause coming up in another month or so. That's in June. Uh, that's right. SodaCon Austin 2018. We just gave you a big cover on that. And we'll be telling you more as we get closer. Of course, Hometown Hero. Of course, I love these guys. They got some uh, really great juice. I keep it right here on my desk. Uh, artists, all local Austin artists, small handcrafted artisan batches. And of course, if you want to save a little money, mention us. Use the promo code NBNN. Click on the links provided. You'll save 20% on your purchase at Hometown Hero. Coil more wands, putting the magic in your hands. Scrota's music service. You need a bard, you can hire Scrota. The VMC. Black Rock Cove, located in the Quell region next to the town of Etzer, where you can get your crafting needs fulfilled by all the vendors. They're all rock solid prices across the board, so you ain't got to wonder what you're paying. Right near the Elysium Exeter Mines for your mining convenience. Viral.com for all your license strategy, avatar swag, t shirts, hats, patches, bumper stickers. You get sticker relics by real. You get the new bumper sticker by becoming a patron or going out to the NBNN website. And of course, again, you want to save some money at relics by real.com. NBNN, save you 10% at your purchase price. And of course, last but not least, the Shroud Marketplace. Shroudmarketplace.com for all your virtual vendables right here inside Shroud Avatar. And Jack's going to tell you yeah, all yeah, about it. Yeah, know what? Shroudmarketplace.com. The place to go buy or sell anything Shroud of the Avatar related. Anything. Over a hundred different vendors, reg different players registered as vendors. Each vendor is responsible for maintaining their own inventory and setting their own prices. So you can find all kinds of things from accounts to game gold, crowns of the obsidian, store credit, or all the way you to services. Anything and everything. Right. And if you want to start selling your stuff and start earning some cash, you might as well register for an account and then click on vendor registration and start listing your items. You get to set your own price. 
which is awesome. And then don't forget, there is a small commission for the marketplace and uh, also PayPal takes their, their chunk of everything. But you know what? Great place to do everything. You get free advertising for your stuff. Hey, you know, I know. You get free it's like, advertising. You it's get like, rid of look, that. Look at that Mardi Gras. Up your bank box, I, you know? Laz is selling Mardi Gras bundles and like release 49 items. Other people are selling Mardi Gras garland strands. And it's I like that's you, from uh, Skaggy. We got weddings yeah. and more because we got the whole package. And yeah. of course, I'm selling every bundle that I. That you've got left? Of. That's right, and I've got several and packages, very affordable for those folks who missed them. Very simple, Th that's very right. easy. And you can even find some leveling help, th some those pet quest help. I mean, you can find anything and everything at shroudmarketplace.com. So go register an account, start buying stuff, and or wedding services. start start that's selling. Yeah, wedding I know services too. I tell yeah. you, what, everything, anything you can think of is available. As long as it's not a bannable offense, it's a free game. Yeah, and you know what time it is? It is a time for us to thank the most important people around here. And that's you guys that have donated and or cheered or done whatever. Love you guys. But everybody else, we also love you too. We couldn't do the show without you guys. And we do it for you. So thank you for watching Twitch, YouTube, or listening on Radio Free Britannia. Woohoo! That's right. Thank you, everybody. We'll be back with more tomorrow right here on NBA. Till then. I'm Jack. And we are NBNN. Have a great day. We'll be back tomorrow with Roundup. Bye-bye, everybody. Bye-bye. Thanks for having me, guys. Oh, thanks for coming. Tried to get you early on.